Hello everybody and welcome to Saddleback College in the city of Mission Viejo. Game four of the high school football season for the Santa Margarita Eagles as they hosted the Westlake Warriors. Hi everybody, I'm Paul Higgins. It would be a festive night if you're an Eagle fan. Coach Fisher getting his team ready to go out on special teams to start this game. On the very first punt of the game, the ball hits off the Westlake player. Santa Margarita is there to recover the fumble. And they wasted little time getting into the end zone. It would be a handoff to Chad Magger. He goes in for the touchdown. The offensive lineman in the end zone to greet Chad and deservingly so because they opened up a huge hole for him to run through. That would be the first touchdown of many in the first half. Seven nothing Eagles. Seems like each and every week we highlight Abdul Malik McLean. How about this play? He goes right to the ball carrier. Abdul has plenty of speed and it seems like each and every week he's making the big plays. William Green goes in for the touchdown right here. Once again, a great lane that opens up for the offensive line of the Santa Margarita Eagles. That would make it 14 to nothing. You see the lane, Green finds it, he scoots in for the score. It was absolutely a perfect night for high school football in the city of Mission Viejo at Saddleback College as the moon starts to rise. Grant Calcaterra, he gets the handoff. On the end of the round, he goes all the way for the touchdown. Grant turns the corner with plenty of speed. That would make it 21 to nothing in the second. And then a little bit later on, Richard Wagner. We all thought he was tackled here, but somehow he scoots out of the pack and goes in for the score. That would make it 28 to nothing. The Eagles were on cruise control in the second quarter against Westlake. Wagner celebrating with his team right there, deservingly so. And then a little bit later on, Wagner looks, looks, has plenty of time, decides to hold on to the football, finds a lane open wide enough for a truck to go through. The Eagles score, that made it 35 to nothing. Once again, take a look at the lane and the hole that the offensive linemen open up. This is an excellent play to see great vision by a running back. Check this out. Chad, as we stop it here, there are six white jerseys surrounding Chad. He will find his own lane as he bounces to the right, and then he cuts inside for the touchdown. Terrific running by Chad. That makes it 42 to nothing in the first half. On defense, the Eagles did an exceptional job shutting down the Warriors offense. Alex Killender there goes in for the sack on the quarterback. The halftime show was equally as impressive as the Eagles were in the first half of football. Always exciting to go to a Santa Margarita home game. Second half action coming your way and the defense played exceptional on this night. David Xavier Chen gets in on the tackle. And then Michael Matranga, he also played some fantastic football. He escapes his block and brings down the quarterback. Kyle Hastings would get a touchdown in the third quarter as he follows his blockers. They open up a lane. He goes in for the touchdown. That would make it 49 to nothing after the PAT. And then defense prevails one more time. Quarterback looking, looking, trying to find somewhere to go, but eventually he will throw up the ball and it's intercepted by Jordan Tolner. So the Eagles playing on all cylinders in week four of the high school football season as they win it 49 to eight. Athletes in Motion is the home for weekly Santa Margarita football highlights. Until next week, I'm Paul Higgins. Thanks for watching.